Western Port is a beautiful Ramsar site that's at the heart of Bunurong country. The Ramsar Convention is the United Nations agreement on how to conserve and best use wetlands. So to be a Ramsar site means you're a wetland of international importance. And my goodness, Western Port is. There are nine criteria by which a wetland will be assessed. Meet one of them and you can become a Ramsar listed wetland. But of the nine, incredibly, Western Port meets seven of them. Part of that is the range of habitats. It's rare to find such extensive belts of salt marsh. And then there's the mangroves and the seagrass meadows. And in the deepest part of the bays, there's a bryozoan reef, an ecological assemblage, which is found nowhere else in the world. But also the rare species. You've got the Australian grayling, a threatened fish the eastern curlew, the largest of the migratory shorebirds that leaves Western Port and goes all the way to Siberia to breed. Or the tiny little red net stint, weighs as much as a Tim Tam, and also spends the summer here getting fat and ready for that epic migration. The salt marsh, that's a key resource for the orange-bellied parrot, a critically endangered, beautiful bird, one of only two migratory parrots in the world. At any one time, there's over 20,000 birds on the waters and the coastal habitats of Western Port. That's a huge number. And in that 20,000, there's a significant percentage of certain species that just rely on this area. If Western Port wasn't here, the whole species would be under threat. When you talk about Western Port, a lot of people will think about fishing because it's so rich in fish. It's where the elephant fish breed. The seagrass meadows are a nursery ground for King George whiting and other species. And indeed, that's another one of the Ramsar criteria. Is it a haven for fish? Being listed as a Ramsar wetland does put an obligation on the Australian government to conserve it. Not just for us and not just for the people who come here, but for the world. It's a global treasure and that's why all of us should look after it.